But um, okay, so now I'm back in my items, and here's the presentation I've created. I can just click on this and look at it if I want. If I want to do anything with it, I click here and I edit. But what I actually want to do now is um, share it. So there's a couple of things. Like if I click on this, anyone with URL below can access this item. I just and I take that. That I can then send to anybody, anywhere, outside Fanshawe, and whatever I've got in my ePortfolio, they can look at it. They can look at this presentation, not the whole thing, just this presentation. And that's the thing that I would normally go to tiny URL and get a short version of it. But as well as that, I can, that's one thing. And just because you've done that doesn't mean say anyone can look at it. They can only look at it if you send them the link. The uh, other thing, though, is add users and groups. And if you go to uh, users, if you go to, if you go to, sorry, let me stick with that, sharing groups, you'll see the class here. It doesn't, it's not in there right now, it must be in the class, but you'll see your class there and you can pick that class and add it. And then you'll have to, um, select that and then done and send it right. Or also, another thing you can do, which is what you'll be wanting to do, let me just, uh, <coughs> just say done. The poor class is going to be sharing this with me. But, um, if I go to share and add users and groups and click on users and then I put my name in, or somebody, anybody else's name in the class that you want to share with, you'll get, you'll find that person on the list. I'm the only W. Wilson in, at Fanshawe, and the reason I am is with such a common name is that students have an underscore and faculty don't. So uh, I will, I will do this. I will, I can add, I can see, see assessments for others, add assessments. I can give other people the ability to edit this, and then I just add and. Done and send insight. And then if I want to add something to the invite, uh, higher, whatever that is, okay. You'll see in a minute, you'll see an, uh, an email appearing from me to me. And that will be me sharing my own equal file. Who knows how long it'll take, but that's, so that's how you share your ePortfolio presentation with other people. So you can share it universally if you have the link, or you can pick individual people to share it with or a class. Okay, so that's all for today, and thank you.